being in, uh, coming way late in Michigan like that? Yeah, just you know we're playing our best ball right now, and we're the defending national champions. I think that still plays a factor. How much would you like to see Zeke in New York City next weekend at the high school presentation? A lot. Uh, I feel like he deserves it. You know, all those backs, you know, they're good running, good running backs, and they run the ball hard, and Zeke runs the ball hard. But if you watch him block, I don't, I don't know if other other backs are doing that. I mean, they could be. I don't, I don't watch him, but I just know Zeke is plowing people over and cutting people and playing really hard without the football. And I think that should be taken into consideration as well in the Heisman uh, voting or whatever it is. But I think, you know, maybe a little biased, but. No matter what happens, you know, wherever you guys end up, whether it's a playoff or a bowl game, how important is it for you know, the program as a whole to get a win and, and establish dominance again going into the offseason? Yeah, um, Coach Meyer always talks about this program as like a freight train that's rolling. You know, this freight, whatever happened a few weeks ago, you know, this freight train's still rolling and it's not stopping. So I think any game we play is big and, you know, we got to come out and dominate and play Buckeye football. Pat, you'll probably ask this already, but how different was it last week having Coach Warner upstairs and having Jimmy Cordell and uh, Tim Hinton downstairs just for, for the slobs? Uh, it was a little different. I mean, since I've been here, he's always been down there with us coaching. And he told us the night before the game that he's not going to be down there. And I was like, all right, you know, he's going to go up there. He's going to do his thing, what he's good at. And we're going to go down there and do our thing. And we trust Jimmy. He's a good coach. He played. He knows. So uh, we were all comfortable with it. And it was working out good. So we, it was fine. What the good work. It worked yeah. really well. Right. You think that's just more rhythm on offense, or is it just you played better? Yeah, I mean, we obviously played a lot better. Everyone was on the same page, and we were running some tempo, which Coach Warner likes tempo. Everyone, Coach Meyer, everyone, we were a tempo team, so that we were getting them tired and just running our base stuff, and it was letting us hit them in the mouth and get they were tired, and we were just going, going, going. So it was working. From this time last, last question. Year, from this time last year, you guys held your own destiny. To have somebody else have your destiny. How hard is that as a player to sit back and knowing that you'll be watching this week and hoping other people do stuff for you instead of you guys controlling what you guys did last year? Yeah, you know, we'd like to have it the other way around, but we can't control it anymore. And, you know, after we lost that game, we kind of knew that that's what it was going to be. So we decided to put that aside, you know, do what we could have done and just be the team up north and we did it in the right way. So that's all we could have controlled and that's what we did. So we're just, you know, waiting. How does one celebrate being named 